So right now, Gamescom opening night live is going on, and we got some new footage of Crimson Desert, which is by Pearl Abyss, the same people that worked on Black Desert. This is pretty much their single-player style game, and it looks very interesting from what we've seen so far. So today we're going to watch that video, give some reactions, some first impressions on what we're seeing, and uh, take it from there. So let's get started. Pearl Abyss. Crimson Desert. This game looks like it's got a, a little bit of everything, and I even get some feelings of Assassin's Creed in areas. You'll see what I mean. The combat looks pretty clean. And if it controls well, I mean, looks like it could be a good time. I, oh. The environments look beautiful, too. It's like you can get quests from local villagers. <laughs> Spotted crime, okay. So there is a... a Morality, not morality, but if you do a crime, you're going to get some some sort of punishment for it. You do some fishing? Okay. Fight a giant crab. Have some pets. Very good. Very good. Beautiful right there. Whoa. Now I'm curious if this game is gonna have like a full on like single player story for it's or if it's just gonna be like exploration. Yeah, there you go. There's that's what I mean when I said Assassin's Creed earlier. Climbing uh, a lot of free running, it looks like. Different armor styles. <laughs> That is crazy. That too. This game has a little bit of everything. But honestly, everything I'm seeing here, I'm, I'm in. Like, I am down for this. As long as it turns out good. <laughs> Throwing people around. Quick time events, love to see it. We need more games with quick time events, to be honest. Oh, that's sick. It's like an upscale, a 8K upscaled Zelda look right there. <laughs> Crimson Desert. Man, that I really don't know what to expect, but it, it it looks like it's it's a lot of things that it's trying to do and hopefully they do it well, especially with I mean, I I went back to Black Desert recently and had a pretty good time with it. Um it wasn't as story focused as I kind of wanted it to be, but if they primarily put out something that's very open world, story focused, single player, Go do this, go do that, giving you actual quests that like matter. And then uh, I, I think that's a great combo and something I'm very interested in seeing. So if you guys are too, definitely leave a like on the video, subscribe. Let me know if you have any feedback on this game or if you've been watching it at all. Uh, for now, thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next one.